Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, The Social Pie. I am Ayan Khan and today in this video, we are going to solve a question that is integral from 0 to 1, 1 upon square root of natural log of negative natural log of x dx. Okay? So guys, there is going to be an interesting answer for this. So let's start solving. So guys, let's start solving by doing substitution. Okay? So let u equals to negative ln of x. Okay? So du will be negative 1 upon x dx. So the value of 1 upon x dx. So the value of dx will be dx is equal to negative x du. Right? But the value of x, this is, since this is natural log of x, we can write this as u equals, x is equals to e to the negative x like this negative u okay like this so if you plug back we get integral now since this is 0 and this is negative ln of x we can write this as natural log of 1 minus natural log of x since natural log of 1 is 0 right so this will be natural log of 1 upon x like this so if this is 0 1 upon x that's infinity so this is infinity here positive infinity and since this is 1 this will be 1 upon 1 natural log of 1 that's 0 so this is 0 like this now if we plug back we get 1 upon that's square root of u right and this is and dx is e to the negative u times du that's du not okay like this and we have this negative sign also so this will be we can factor this out so we get negative integral of uh, positive infinity to 0 1 upon square root of 1 upon square root of u times e to negative u du now since this is negative here we can write this as integral from 0 to infinity 1 upon square root of u times e to the negative u du now this is actually equals to integral from 0 to infinity e to the negative u upon square root of u du like this okay now this form this is actually equals to gamma function of 1 by 2 gamma of 1 by 2 and it's uh, it's because gamma function gamma of n is integral from 0 to infinity okay and this is e to the n minus e to the n minus 1 times uh, actually this is actually n minus 1 times e to the negative x dx like this okay so this is gamma of 1 by 2 now let's find out what's the gamma of 1 by 2 so there's a formula called the Euler's reflection formula okay Euler's reflection formula and the formula says that gamma of z times gamma of 1 minus z 1 minus z is equals to pi or uh, pi is pi upon sine of pi z now if we put gamma of 1 by 2 here so this is gamma of 1 by 2 times gamma of 1 minus 1 by 2 so this will be pi upon sine of pi upon 2 like this okay now this is gamma of 1 by 2 and this is 1 minus 1 by 2 so that's 1 by 2 so this will be gamma of 1 by 2 whole to power of power 2 equals to pi and sine of pi by 2 that's 1 so this is 1 here now take square of both sides we get gamma of 1 by 2 this is actually equals to square root of pi okay now that means that square root of pi is equals to integral from 0 to 1 1 upon square root of negative ln of x dx so we got so we got our solution okay so guys, thanks for watching my channel. Please subscribe, like, share and comment. Thank you.